For the back, this is the Sport Legacy, the 2020 version. Shout out at Drenet of Subaru. They in Drenet. They have this one in. They just got it in. They, this Sport one has a like, different kind of black wheels on it. These ones are 18. You got the black mirrors on the Sport model as the turn signals. Uh, you got the small coat head amps. And then you got the all-wheel drive and stuff like that. You mean then you got the parking sensors. You mean you got the trunk. This is the trunk. You got your your car mat, your mat in here and stuff like that. You got your sport mats and stuff. You can change the yeah, I pretty. Then you can put the seats down in the back to fold them down. Now let's go to the rear of the car. See how it is. This is the rear. So I five a seven. So this is how. This is how it is. And you got your written right here. Your USB ports to charge your phone. You can put stuff right here and then over here. You got your cup holders. Then you got your lights over here. You got your window control right here. So this one is running at like thirty thousand. These are the, the options on it. So this one got the smart key access. No with Subarus. So you just press right here to out the door. And then when you're coming up to the car, it has a sensor behind it. Then this is the inside of the Subaru Legacy Sport. So the upgrades to this one, you put your foot on the brake and then you press the button. This one is they update the screen and all that stuff. They make it your kayak you inside the um <laughs> I like this big screen right here. It looks really nice. I think this this is pretty neat. Um let's see this is your radio control right here. Um this is the go to your menu. I got the scream. The scream looks like a Tesla. It's crazy. Um, I think this should have. So this is pretty nice, though. I like how they do the whole scream like this, and then you can pinch and zoom. This is an upgrade. So the 2020, the 19s and the 18s will have this, but this is like a big, nice upgrade. Um. Then you got your heated seats, your do zone system, and then you show your temperature right here. It's pretty nice. And then you got Apple CarPlay and all that. Do you mind if I show you a couple features? Sure. Okay. So, my. Hey, how you guys doing? I'm Drew. I'm going to be showing you guys a little bit more features that you might not know about. So. The My Subaru app right over here, you could actually get to customize the vehicle to your own settings. You could set your own temperature before the, you could even have auto stop and start with that feature with the My Subaru. Slide over right here with your shortcuts. You could add different shortcuts you want on your screen display, and you could also move these things around as well. If you hold, you could actually move it wherever you want, just like, like a, a tablet. Ta yeah, like a tablet. Like a tablet. Right. And if you go right here to your apps, yeah. these are the apps that come on the vehicle. As you know, all Subarus, all models are standard with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. All features. You hear that? So. You hear that Androids? You hear that Apple Car you hear that Android yeah, Auto? Yep, there you go. Android Auto, Apple yeah. CarPlay. Um, with the travel links right over here, you could access, see all the f nearest fuel and also yeah. the prices. It gives you the prices when the vehicle gets to know where you're at.
Yeah. Um, after that, you could also have your favorite sport team. You can keep up with them if you're into stocks. Yeah. You can even watch the stock market. All of those things in your field, man. Yeah. It's amazing. So then you go over one more. You also have the weather. Um, it shows you the weather and stuff weather. like that. Yep. Then up here, it shows you more like, information, too. Mm-hmm. It shows you the weather up here, too. Now, you know how most weather shows you just one day or kind yeah. of weather? Well, now in the Subaru, you can see five days out. Five days. And I noticed that I added them in Subarus. You can do that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You, got, you guys want to eat that do zone, too. Yeah. 2020 version is nice. Man. You got your USB port, you got your extra part to bring. Let's see the backup camera. So all your plays right here, and you guys got your parking sensors. You can activate. You hold it. You just turn it on. There oh, so you guys have to hold it. Yeah, hold this. Until you hear that beat. There it go. Okay. <laughs> Same way to turn it up. Then you got your distance to control right here when you turn the steering wheel. I wish it would take up the whole screen though, then I'm just nitpicking. <laughs> That's true. A lot, yeah. of, a lot of people said the same thing. The same thing for the navigation. Yeah. Take the whole screen, so you can get optional cool seats on this one, but this one only comes with heated seats. Heated, heated and cooling. So. Oh, so you got the, heat, the cooling seats too. Okay, my bad, y'all. Sorry, I like heated seats only. That's Tour, what I'm saying. Touring. The tour model, they have the cool seats. Sorry, sorry. Then you can, I think you can get a 60 view camera on the tour model too. Yep, yep, yep. Then you got your homing, you got your compass, you got your sunroof. Yep. If you guys wondering. And this is kind of like OnStar, but what's your own name for this? This is Starlink. Starlink. So, Starlink. How much do you pay for this? Like? Starlink, it depends on how long you want to subscribe for. Yeah. So most customers on average, you do get 36 months. 36 free. months free. And then after that, um, I think it's between 74.99. I want to say. That's pretty cool. For a year. And this is yeah. And with this, it comes with um, if you if you have these features, this yeah. is your emergency. Yeah. If you were to get to, if the airbags get deployed, yeah. This will automatically. Let 911 know that you've oh. been in a car accident and they'll be on your rescue. Now, this has more signal yeah. than your average cellular has. So, if you're in the woods, yeah. you, wouldn't have cell, you wouldn't have service in your phone. Yeah. In the car, you will. Oh. It's a lot stronger. Because I know I got the automakers going to this mm -hmm. system. It's also a safety feature. It helps out with your insurance as well. Yeah. Um, so, you guys wondering, this is a helper screen over here. I always wonder how. Okay, so this I'll is. Move the, it. So. It's oh, it's right here. Yeah. Oh yeah, I can the rest of them. So this is how you change. Over here, you can you got your information. It's right over here. So this this is supposed to show the radio over here. Which one? This one over here. Yeah, this is supposed to be a source yeah. source button where if you were on your radio tabs and you had some presets already saved, yeah. it would just help you sort through it. Okay. So that way you wouldn't need to touch the screen while driving. It's just another safety feature again. Yeah. And this is your intelligent mode and your sports mode. Yeah. The super button that you just press. And then this is for your um Yankee assist. This is for your adaptive cruise control. All right here. Right. So yeah. this is to activate um, cruise control. Yeah. Now the 2020s have a new um, adaptive cruise control system. Yeah. You remember how last year you were kind of sw yeah. swirly back in your lane with yeah. this button? Now this button actually follows the car in front of you and kind of guides you through it. Really? Yeah. So it's like a self self steering. driving. Self steering. Right? So does it monitor your face and all that stuff or? Uh, not this model again. That'll be in your. Um, so how are you on? You supposed to keep your your hands off the steering wheel. Um, you always have to keep your hands on the steering wheel. Uh, it's, just, it's just an assist. Oh, this is assist. It's an assist. Okay. 
And here you got your yellow buttons to open your trunk and your eye, the eye control over here. And then this is for your windows, this is for your mirrors. You can get folded mirrors on the higher models. This one don't have it. So let me make y'all look at the storage. So what's this like to put your coins and stuff? Mm -hmm. Then you got your charge port right here. You got your cup holders. And here it's real nice. I got the red station. And you can put your stuff back right here. Then this is your apartment right there. Okay, and you that wheel yaks. Okay, call Subaru. <laughs> <laughs> And then you get your powder controls right here. You can get upper upper models you can get um automatic wiper control on your um upper models. So is it upper if you guys looking for upper features, cool. Is this is this right for me? I would choose this one because I find this just right for me. But if you guys looking for more features like Yedder and stuff like that and ventilated seats and more features. And this one has blind spot monitoring too. And eyesight too. So that's is these if you guys one of these is what these cameras is for. That's a Subaru, they're all about safety. So any other features you wanna go over with the um, system? It's again into your settings here is where now you get to turn off all the safety features which you don't want to do because that's why yeah. you get in this car is for the safety features so you'll go over here to your cars and it'll display all the safety features so everything now is just a touch of a button yeah so every all your settings are going to be in your screen it's like a tablet yeah, just like a tablet so you got your uh vehicle automatic hold right here so you we'll just press that to turn, keep it on. turn that on to keep it on now this will come off when you turn off the vehicle so you yeah. gotta manually turn it on so if you if this is a feature that you really love really want to always turn on you can yeah. also add that to your shortcuts all right um now that's just the safety features uh let's go oh are you guys asking about the lights it has ld lights and then on the higher ones you can adapt to the item right so this one has the full LD lights. You guys wonder. Um, so, and then this one doesn't have the upgraded sound system. This no. one has the regular, regular sound, sound system. system. No so, harm you, so you did the harm recording on, on the higher sound system. Correct. But the bass system sounds very good. What I hear. Correct. Here. Yeah. You take this it out. It has enough bass for me. So what's AVH stand for? Automatic vehicle hold. So it will hold the vehicle. Right. So yeah. let's say you had a red light. Yeah. You want to release your feet off the brake. Yeah. So what it does is keeps the vehicle at at its certain spot. Yeah. So it won't roll forward if you were to release the brakes. Yeah. Now that will not work on a hill. It's only on the flat surface. Law of gravity. Okay. Right. So. And you got a hot spot in here too, so right. I see. You can so set up your hot spot and your Wi-Fi. Okay. Thank you for the help. I got yeah, touching this. This took like a Tesla screen, right? <laughs> this this was a good thing what Subaru did to make this whole screen. Cause I remember how this used to be up there, then this used to just be down here. Now it's just all grinning into one. Yeah. So are these older drivers have to get accustomed to this? Um, not really. Well, now we started a program called Love Encore Program. Yeah. Where they go to, where they get to get another delivery. Yeah. So if they have any questions after they get it, yeah. That's why we're here for to help them understand the vehicle. Yeah. Help them go over the new features that came along on the vehicle. Yeah. So they always got someone there to help them out if they ever feel like this is overwhelming. But it should be easy to them because it's just like using your phone. You right. Know what I mean? Right. And some people just like to get in and go. So the way we set it up, yeah. I'll have everything that they like doing in the car. So if yeah. they like the radio, a station they listen to all the time, yeah. I kind of display it right there on the screen for them. That way they can just tap and go. Yeah. So, can I go back outside, y'all? So, subscribe in the yard for more videos. And... 
So you want to check this car out, go. If you want to check this, this car out, just go to Subaru, Drenet, pick up one. These are nice, they drive real nice, they're liable, they're very safe cars. If you want one for your first kid or your first car, check out Subaru. They're very liable cars and they, they're good cars. And you got your LDI's right here and you got your LD time running amps right there. And you got your, your LD fog amps over here too. So it's a nice package and it's all running at 30,000 with some optional package onto it. So subscribe and a like for more videos y'all. Stay tuned. Oh, and you know what? And I got to tell you all about the Yip Sporter on the back too, how I forget that. So stay tuned for more videos and subscribe and a like. And after grind for more videos, tell me what I should I do next. So subscribe and a like for more videos. Bye y'all.